exponent problems like this seem crazy, but there's an approach we can use. There's a pretty simple rule we'll start to work with for exponents that are done like this, where an exponent is raised to another exponent. In this case, we've got to solve for the question mark over here. So we want to figure out what this side of it looks like. So let's rewrite that here. So we've got 2 to the n to the power of 3. So if I just expand that out, 2 to the n to the power of 3 is 3. That was a bit messy. 2 to the n, 2 to the n, 2 to the n is equal to 2 to our mystery variable. And we know from multiplication that this is going to be equal to 2 to the n plus n plus n is equal to 2 to the question mark, or in simpler language, 2 to the 3n is equal to 2 to the question mark. So, and that's a common rule. If you have an exponent raised to a, another exponent, you multiply them to create a single power. So our bases are the same here. So we can actually just remove the bases. And what we're left with is that our exponents, the powers, are going to be the same. So 3n is equal to our mystery variable. And that's our answer right here.